Hi, I'm Joe Green and it's day four of Game City. So today we're going to be talking to Lee Alexander, who's actually a gaming journalist. And we're going to be hearing what she has to say about the industry and different things. Also, we're going to be talking to a Toto who make their own musical instruments. It's going to be a fun day, guys, and I'm not lying. Giant pencils. I'd estimate there's probably about 20,000 in that bundle. To, um, I try to help be a good ambassador for the event because it's very much in line with the goals that I have as a journalist, which is I like how they try to combine, you know, they try to bring games out into the city and they try to make it something that anyone walking around Nottingham can come and join in. And they want to make, they want to lower the barriers to entry around games by having the two big screens in the square this year. They're hoping to attract people to come and try games who don't, without them realizing, you know what I mean? So that's a message that I really believe in. we've been working on an Atoto workshop. So Atoto is a DIY uh, build your own electronic musical instrument kit. So it allows you to plug different metallic or conductive objects in and use them to play and trigger sounds. So this was day four at Game City. We've showed you a little bit about what's been going on, but don't forget we're in the market square for the next four days. So just come along, have a chat and get involved. I'm Joey Green and this is Game City. And some pencil erasers for rubbing out mistakes. We've all made mistakes. I know I have.